Hello everybody and welcome to this, the next installment of the offline educational series. Before I begin here, let me wish you all the very best of prosperity for 2023. I wanted to get this message to you before we start the main body of the trading week. We are on, um, we will be on Monday the 9th of January, so non-farm payroll for January is behind us. That doesn't mean you can take things any less seriously, but I wanted this message to get to you before you begin on Monday. Now, you're looking at something I made here called Inspect the Morse. <laughs> obviously due to the dots and the dashes. Also because I keep telling you all to interrogate the price action and the indicators. Inspector Morse was a great TV show featuring a beautiful old Jaguar of the lead character. So I hashed this up just for your visual entertainment while I speak. Because this is mainly about mindset. This educational mindset. Now, for your early in the year wake up call, if you always do what you always did, then you will always get what you always got. So if you're winning and doing well or improving and getting better, then that's perfectly fine and no problem at all, since you are at least heading in the right direction. However, if you're beginning and or battling, especially with something along the lines of bad habits, then it really might be time to take a step back and review your steps in the process. Do you have a daily trading plan? Have you reviewed it and checked that it is functional and fits in with your life? Have you followed it? Do you properly understand your strategy, the rules and all of the associated terms and conditions? Do you keep a journal? Does your journal show that you have in fact followed the steps and the rules whilst complying with all of the associated terms and conditions? Details matter. So it is very important that you can answer all of those questions on a prerequisite basis. Additionally, you know those self-help books, self-hypnosis or some other method of extracting a pointless spend from your wallet? They're probably not going to help you, especially if you're in the bad habits category. So let me save you the 10 grand now. Cut your crap stop the bad habits and force yourself to take the next right step. Sink or swim, ladies and gentlemen. You save yourself or you go under. Nobody is looking out for you. In your lessons, in our live sessions together or our one-to-one -one sessions, I can, yes, and I am looking out for you. And if you're in my live sessions, then you know we have yet to have our bottoms handed to us on a silver plate. Generally, we do very well. We can always, so far, demonstrate that we can predict what's going to happen. All of you in our group, all of you know that. So I'm looking out for you in those sessions. But those sessions are scheduled and they're finite. When they end, typically after an hour or so, you're able to go back to your own ways. If you have bad habits, then I'm not there to slap your hand when you're over trading or exiting trades too early or trading absent a stop loss, moving the stop loss, range trading or trading too high a stake. I hope I've woken you up to some of the very serious facts of life here, not only when you set out on the journey as a trader, but generally for that balance that we need in life. I've made this statement, if you like, or this uh, offline educational, largely from feedback of perhaps a couple or few um, people who generally seek one-to-one -one sessions. They get them, of course they get them, 
but we discuss things in those sessions we discuss a path a right path a correct path to follow a remedial path however the steps I give are not taken and the very next week we're back having the same conversation about exiting without reason about entering without reason about random entries and random exits um, I don't know some people just want to be shouted at I'm not going to shout at you if we're on a one-to-one -one session and you haven't taken the advice from what we spoke about last time I listen with half an ear and consider that you're very lucky that I'm listening at all I want your effort I want your input if you're not doing what we discussed it's like going to the doctor and getting a, a remedy or a potion and then not taking the medicine all right your health is on your shoulders your financial well-being is on your shoulders I can lead the horse to water I can't make it drink I can show you the right thing to do I can't make you do it the reason I wrote those books so I wouldn't be repeating everything that I say so often problem is so many don't read the stuff that's hidden in those books and any other books that you like I'm working on the trading code for this year the comedy of errors your feedback is my content there not really very funny now is it we have choices ladies and gentlemen and yes the majority of the group you're doing really well you're listening you're trading well and I'm happy with you but those few of you that insist on implementing your bad habits and maintaining your bad habits well bad habits generally see people into early graves bad habits at trading see people into empty bank accounts make your choice choose wisely and trade safe I look forward to seeing you all on the next live session if I've ranted and told you off I apologize if the telling off isn't aimed at you or it doesn't befit what you're doing in your trading then fine you don't need worry you probably don't need watch this session but it's there just to remind you when you fall off the wagon there is a next right step there is a way back trade safe ladies and gentlemen bye bye